Hey guys, Dave here, back again with another episode. Um, today we're going to have 353 plus 400. Didn't go too well on the hunt, so I had to throw another little top up in there. Um, got a pretty decent selection today. Got King Kong Cash, Lost Relics, Beetlejuice Megaways, Star Clusters, Drago Jewels, Spartacus Megaways, Chocolates, Gonzo's Quest, Montezuma, Ted Megaways, and Vikings Unleashed Megaways. So, ended up being pretty good hunt. Got quite a few games in there today. Um, gonna set uh, presidents here and just collect. Haven't been too successful on the old gambles of recent. And King Kong Cash. Who knows, you can uh, jump up here. Never know what you're gonna get. 50x would be nice. To be honest, I reckon I wouldn't do this one again. I'm gonna gamble it next time. Although we just got two fives. Okay, so it slowed down pretty bad at the end. 14 quid from King Kong Cash. We still have heaps of games left. 10 to go, so a total of 11 games off the 651, and uh, most of the stakes are on 80 pence. Um, Beetlejuice is on 50 pence. Montezuma on 90, but yeah, more or less. Alright, we see the box down the bottom there. Just need that one little brick to break. Nope. Wow, this game can suck, can it? Ah, oh, I just missed again. Wow, that was pretty disappointing in the end. Uh, I'm going to take a 17 quid away from Lost Relics. Um, that was a little bit tricky, wasn't it? Um, got Beetlejuice up next. Um, and while I got the opportunity, I want to give a shout out to John Hart and Darren Phillips. Few chunky wants to get in, eh? Three quid seventy. Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice. It's showtime. Okay, eight spins here. Okay, this is our first time up. King on one would have been decent, or a ten on three. There is wild there. If we can get that green premium on three, we'd be away laughing. Full line there, potential. So a couple of pretty close spins here. A few very close potential spins. Megaways 108 <laughs> until it opened up. I've ridden Beetlejuice down as 80 pence, it doesn't have the option for 80 pence, it's 50 and 1 pound and higher. So it is on 50 pence. Here we go, a few decent little ones there. Mm -hmm. 
Nice, we're going to use this multiplier. Always get dead spinned out at the end, eh? Decent mega ways. For 20 quid. So 6450 from Beetlejuice mega ways. Took a 100x at least from that. First time today. So yeah, 64 from that. We're going to move on to Star Clusters. Um, this was a suggestion. And then Drago Jewels. Now, I know a lot of you guys have a bit of, you know, mixed feelings about that game. I reckon today could be a good day on it. Um, because it's been absolutely trash <laughs> of, of late. Okay, two spins here. Gonna need some decent clusters. Wanna get some more spins. I barely ever get uh, more spins on this. Bit of green in there. And the stars are touching. And we're more than halfway to free spins as well. 34 quid for that. Got some touching stars up there. Oh, that's a tricky line. Need... Need more spins here, and that's gonna be it. Um, so what's that? 14 and 50. 64 quid. 52 quid. Okay, 52 quid from Star Clusters. Um, we're gonna move on next. Ah, oh, these big time gamings love to count it out. 52. Okay, so, uh, Drago Jewels is next, and I'm hoping we get a decent setup with uh, the wilds spread out. Um, those uh, mystery eggs are not very good a bit arbitrary of a number um, but if we can get yeah heaps of spins and a decent split on the wilds uh, multiply would be handy too but the mystery symbols are a little bit arbitrary not really sold on them so less purple and all the other colors a blue one would be nice So we do have the three wilds, which is going to be very handy if we can get them to spread out. If they stack, which they sometimes do, less fun. Looks like it could be over here. Okay, so. Seven spins, three wilds, and a three multiplier, so pretty decent setup, I reckon. Okay. Ah, they stacked on two. So that's top symbol, that purple one. That's top premium. 38 quid. Okay. So nearly 50x just straight up. That's another one. We get a full line of that one. He's not the strongest dragon, but it'll still pay. Help of the wilds too. 41 quid. Sweet. So another 50x there. Coming into our last spin here. Can we get a purple? No purple. 
bugger. So, uh, just shy of 100 quid there. Not a bad collection on old Drago Jewels. Hasn't been, it's been a while since I've done well there. So, yeah, pretty happy with Drago Jewels today. Um, Spartacus Megaways is next. This game has been very difficult in the past to bonus. So. Hope you guys enjoy it. Hope, hopefully we get a decent setup though. I don't think you can gamble these. Thirteen quid coming into the bonus, so that's gonna be signs of bigger things to come. Oh, just missed the blank one. Wow, so things could have gone only a couple of options to go worse than this. It's not a very good setup here. We got eight spins and half the screen's pretty much gone. Um so maybe they're just being generous with that 13 quid coming in. But yeah, Megaway's chances significantly lower. So we've gone eight spins with the multiplier moving twice. Yeah. Ouch. Pound 32 on the free spin wins, and the base game gave us 13. So that was pretty horrible of Spartacus Megaways, especially on how long it takes to bonus. You need four of those scatter symbols. Um, chocolates from BTGs up next. Hopefully we get heaps of purples today. Some purple chocolates would be nice. Had a very good go on this the other week. So again, pretty decent one coming in. Five quid to come in to this bonus as well. Now hopefully it's the opposite of Spartacus Megaways. And we got three on the board straight away. Now number two, nothing's touching, so then we do need a color. Greens here will link. We do need a color on two. Well now these will stick, won't they? Oh no. Wild stick. The green stick. Sweet. So the more of these boxes we get, the more the wind's gonna get. We only get seven spins. Yep, that'll be again. This is going to be good. 16 quid. Ah, oh, that would be a little bit more than that. Red is the second best symbol, after all. So, 16 quid from that. Up to 52. Purples. We got purples here, 64 quid, so we're going to double our money and some on the last spin. Thanks to those full line of boxes and linking up on a purple. So, just need one decent hit there. Um, and we're very fortunate that it's come at the end uh, of, the, of the spins. Imagine wasting that on the first one without an extra box. So what's that, 116 quid for that? off an 80 pence stake. So we're going to take our 100x from chocolates. Uh, moving on to Gonzo's quest. Uh, still buzzing from the win we had on the Megaways version of this a couple of weeks ago. If you haven't seen that one, you should definitely check it out. 
Um, did an open, uh, open session, and I recorded in just the open game. We got a massive hit. Stuff you dream about, really. Gonzo's quest always gets me. They always all have to be touching. I can't skip. So Would have liked to get up to 15, the 15 multiplier. Can we do it? No. That's it. So... Let's see if we can get some more wins to add on here, but... As it looks like it on 80 pence steak, we've taken 100x from this. Um, we still need to do a little bit of work here. we got three games to go, and we're chasing 753, so... Yeah, we need these three to pick up more than 100x. So, Montezuma, we're going to do the original, not the Megaways version. Don't mind the feature with the double wheels in Montezuma. I think it's a very good feature. You can lock up a multiplier. 25 spins was there. So again, it could have been worse. We could have got five, but bugger. We only got six spins, so we're gonna need something pretty special here. We got a pretty bad setup. Chasing 753, so yeah, we need 300 to break even from three games. And with six spins here, I don't see it happening. Unless something special happens. Three multiplier. Oh, we got some more spins. Nine more spins. So we're going to get 15 spins all up. Got another wheel down there. I wonder if we can re-trigger within a re-trigger. Re-triggerception. I'm sure one of you guys will tell me in the comment section below. Um, nothing's really going on here. We're stuck around that 20 quid mark still. Wasting so many spins here. Same on Lost Relics, that was a little bit frustrating to watch with just the one box. Playing that game can be really frustrating sometimes. Oh, 10 multiplier. 6 quid, 4 quid. More spins. Really lucky we only have one spin after that. So another nine spins here would be nice. We got ten spins. So this is definitely lining up. We got 49. The multiplier is not massive. It's only two, but we got 49 quid. And if this can top us up, wouldn't mind 100 quid here. And then 100 from the last turn, we break even. But it's got to cut all these dead spins out. 
we have been suffered by lots of deadsmen's this bonus hunt. Spartacus Megaways are disappointing. Damn. We just had 10 spins and we got like a quid or something. With this 2 multiplier, oh my goodness. Last spin, and then we get one more spin of the normal game. Five multiplier. It's gonna be nothing. 52 quid there, um, with... What, 19 plus 6? We had 25 spins there, and it was just dead spinning us the whole time. Um, pretty disappointing just to leave with 50 quid there with the amount of spins we had. Um, Ted Megaways and Vikings Unleashed Megaways, so two games with a lot of potential if we can get a decent multiplier going. To save us, we need 753. Bro, bring it in. Come here. Bring it in. Come on. Bro, bring it in. Come here. Bring it in. Come on. Good job. So, needing over 200, uh, I'm going to go with the more volatile Thunder Wheel. Going to need spins of plenty and some megaways. Uh, six spins <laughs> nice. again and 2,000 megaways. So, could have been worse again, but it's not a very good one. Perhaps a Teddy Brewski? Yeah, we got our work cut out for us now. Very good start here with the multiplier kicking off. Gonna get some more megaways too and some extra spins added. Um, answer me this in the comment section, I'm not really sure, but like say we already started with like a really high amount of megaways, like 20,000 and you only get two chances of filling up on Ted's to re-trigger. So does that mean that if you started with six spins you could only get 10 spins maximum? Because uh, you go up twice in the megaways. Good job. So in theory, would just the best way to bonus this game was to start at the bottom and re-trigger all the way to the top, so you get the most amount of spins and the most opportunity to get a bigger multiplier. I don't know. More unlikely, I guess, to collect ten symbols. Damn, missed out on the coke bottles there. More Ted symbols. Need two more from the last two spins. Bro, bring it in. Come here. Bring it in. Come on. Hopefully we got a premium under these mystery symbols. We definitely need <laughs> nice. a big hit here. Got a 10 multiplier going too. And some wilds up top. Kings will link. 1920. If we can get a 10 on 3 and a queen on 1. No. 19 quid. Bring it in. Need in. some Ted symbols in. here to get another retrigger, another couple of spins. Good job. With the multiplier, that's actually not too bad. 19 quid. Oh, we miss out on those wilds. Last spin here. 20 quid to get our. That's not going to help. 100x, so we're not even going to get our 100x either. So 64 quid here from Ted Megaways, which means Vikings Unleashed has yeah got its work cut out for it. 586 chasing 753. And again, this is one of those games that takes ages to bonus because you need four of those scatter symbols 
Um, so I'm not really that keen to gamble too high. Multiplier I'm not too worried about, I'm just keen on some more spins. More spins, more opportunity. 15 spins sounds good to me. Yeah, I don't know. I reckon I'm pretty happy with that. 15 spins, and the multiplier starts at 1. Fix it. Finishing over 600 and finishing under 600, chasing 753 sounds a lot better. I'm sure you guys will let me know in the comment section what you guys would have done. Um, I have been pretty uh, aggressive in some of my gambles of recent when we were up. Um, and maybe I should be more aggressive when I'm chasing like this. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section. Seven dead spins to start. Finally got a decent set of kings, but no multiplier to match. I guess, oh, and look at that. With a decent multiplier, those two hits would have been... There you have it. Should have gone for the multiplier at the start. 23 quid. Hopefully that's all the dead spins gone. We can still salvage something here with a 7 multiplier. Oh, some more free spins would have been nice. Aces or a queen on 2. Yep. So there you have it, we're not going to finish up, 65 quid, um, it, it would have been a lot better than zero. So we're going to take 65 quid away from Vikings Unleashed Megaways. Again, that one takes me a little while to bonus, so does Vikings, the other game there. Um, but as you can see, 753 and we're going to finish on 651, so down 100 quid for this video, but things have been going pretty good of late. We got 11 bonuses on this bonus hunt for 753 first three or four i got for the first 350 had to add another 400 so second half of the hunt was a lot more generous um i hope everyone enjoyed the content today unfortunately we couldn't get the w and yeah until next time we'll see you later